Hey everybody, welcome back to the Dude's Kitchen and Grills Slacker Vlog number two, Dos, whatever it is. Uh, you're in the Slacker's Lounge, as my buddy Craig over at Behind the Garage Barbecue would call it. Slacker's Lounge, right? Last week's vlog, which was our first one, I promised you I was going to make a white Russian. So, here we go. Let me show you how the dude makes a white Russian. Now the dude's a poor man, right? I don't have a lot of money, so I kind of use cheap vodka sometimes. But, yeah, that sounds about right. We're gonna add some Kahlua. Now the local grocery store was out of heavy whipped cream. That's travesty, right? So I'm using half and half. And it works. Give it a good stir. Mmm, that tastes good. All right, cheers to you guys. Thank you for watching the vlog. That's a damn good white Russian too. I like that. So what do we got cooking this week? Well, once again, El Dutorino's cooking. But we also are cooking a couple other items. One of them is a poor man's picanha. Now I talked about it last week. And here's the deal. I did the video on a brand new camera and I never quite liked the way it came out. So I thought it was so good, why not make another one? And so that's exactly what I'm doing this week. I am making poor man's picanha again. <sighs> You probably saw the short I did the other day for Sid's Garage. And actually, uh, Monday night, Tuesday morning, it had over 500 views. I went to bed and it had 34 when I went to bed and I woke up and I had 596. So hey, I don't know if you guys have ever had any shorts that take have taken off or if you guys do shorts, I don't know, but I'll tell you what. I was pretty pleased with it. I've had two videos this week do really good. The, the dog food one from Zoe had over a thousand views just uh, in a matter of a day. So, yay. What are your guys' thoughts on shorts? Do you like them? Do you do them? You know, I, I gotta say, I like them. But this is, I like Instagram Reels better. By the way, if you're on Instagram, please leave your handle down below in the comments and I'll make sure that I follow you. I took a class the other day on Instagram Reels, and I had two Reels back to back do over 10,000 views. I was pretty pleased with that, and all I do for my shorts on YouTube is I take the Reel, download it, and then load it onto YouTube. And to be honest with you, the Sid's Garage one that I was just telling you about that had 596 views, it did better than what it did on Instagram. But yet the other two did much better on Instagram than they did on YouTube. So I don't know. If I have heard and I'm studying this, so if I find out something, I'll tell you. But Instagram has a new marketing plan where they're actually going to start paying us creators to do lives and reels, all that stuff. But this week's video was uh, beer can ribs versus canned water ribs. And I started out doing this just to see if there was a difference in the flavor of the ribs. Kind of like when you do beer can chicken. You know, I don't know about you guys, but for me, beer can chicken, I can't tell a difference between a normally cooked chicken and beer can. Well, for the ribs, you'll have to watch the video to, uh, to see. But don't forget, my grandson Aiden's on it and he's talking about the dude's kitchen underwear so if you're interested in the dude's kitchen underwear i'll leave his number there and, and you can talk to him <laughs> a couple of a couple of channels that i'd really like to showcase this week one is chef rich and i'll leave his link below i love chef rich i think he's a, a big lebowski fan as much as i am well maybe not as much but he's a big he's a fan of it and he loves the zoe cams and he's really cool because he brings in these other people into his studio or his kitchen 
and he does uh, cooks with them. Sometimes they're disabled citizens, sometimes they're just like this comedian that he has on every once in a while. Great channel. Another one is Hugh Smokin, H-U Smokin. He's only got around 500 subscribers, but he's got a great channel, and the guy knows his stuff. He did a video just recently, I think he was on vacation, where he had to use a, gra a gas grill, and I actually kind of felt bad for the guy, but uh, he's back, so I look forward to seeing more. Cooking with Sherry. She just passed 800 subscribers. Congratulations, Sherry. Let's get her to 1,000. She deserves it. She is awesome. So once again, congratulations, Sherry. Thumbs up. All right, a couple of uh, viewer shout outs. Uh, Molly Purcell. She said that I rock. You got that right, Molly. I do. I really rock. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Thank you so much for that. I really do appreciate it. I really do. Cooking with Stephen and Jacqueline. Stephen's like my brother from another mother. He, he's in the Caribbean. Great guys. I love his style of food. His trendy style. But um, on one of my videos, he goes, Who is this Patrick guy you speak of? And the reason why I want to call this out is I love this community that we have. For Stephen to be able to f feel comfortable enough to be able to say that, you know, I love, I love that. We tease each other. We support each other. Make sure you check out his channel. He's great. Let's get down to some business. B-I-D-N-E-S-S. -S, not business. Business. I just want you to know that I watch as many videos by you guys as possible. And I don't just watch 30 seconds of it and bail. I watch the whole thing. I really do. But my problem is I can only hit the thumbs up button if I'm doing it from my work laptop. We are locked down on being able to do comments. So I just wanted you to know I do watch videos. I bet I watch 15 to 20 videos a day just off my work laptop. So, and I spend a lot of time in the evening. So when you see me comment, that's done from my phone or my laptop that's right down here. White Russian break. New segment, White Russian break. Hey, Marty. Dude, I, I, I finally got, I got the, uh, the venue I wanted. The, I'm performing my dance quintet, you know, my cycle at Crane Jackson's Fountain Street Theater on Tuesday night, and uh, I'd love it if you came and gave me notes. I'll be there, man. I'll be there. All right, now that we got Marty out of the way, I hope you guys like that. Uh, an update for you guys. July 11th, I became a grandfather for the fourth time. Little boy, uh, almost eight pounds comes home today so really looking forward to actually meeting him so yeah excited to have a new family member maybe one of these days he'll take over the dude's kitchen and grill maybe he'll have a splinter channel off of Aiden's or something I don't know all right time to wrap it up this is the vlog guys I hope you all enjoy it I really do if you want to call out or shout out hit me up I'm always there always willing to do it we'll have a vlog next week I hope everybody has a great weekend, and uh, we'll talk soon. All right, peace. Al Wiedersehen. That's for Danya. Ma salam. Later.